Right, I got it. Right, I got it. We're being asked in the confession we're supposed to judge our lives, right? That's what I've been told. These questions sure are strange. I feel like I should be picking the right answer, not what I'm honestly feeling. How have you been answering? I feel like you know if I was lying, so I'm just going with how I really feel. What? Seriously? He asked me if men who want to cheat on their spouses are pathetic or praiseworthy. And since I think that men who bind themselves to one woman forever are boring and have no lives, I thought praiseworthy would be the right answer. I wish they were questions with definite answers, like, when's your birthday? Damn it! There are less of us now. I won't lose. I'll climb for them too. Damn it! Learning techniques? Climbing like there's no tomorrow? Is there really any meaning to life? Did you know this? Male bees effectively eviscerate themselves when mating with a queen bee. Male praying mantises approach females knowing that they'll be eaten. Are you trying to say that men only exist just to have sex? That's stupid. Brainy talk. From a human's point of view, it might be pathetic. But the animal kingdom has its own way of seeing things. Huh? He's trying to say that what you live for is all up to you. Smart guys have their own ways to cheer you up. <laughs> I'm glad you're safe. We're almost halfway there. I feel like we can make it if we keep sticking together and talk things through. Hmm. I see you're safe. 
Let's talk about our techniques. We've all got to keep climbing. Let's work together and get out alive. This technique just hit me. Allow me to explain timber. If you want to drop an entire wall, leave a supporting block and push out all the rest. Then push the supporting block and the wall will all fall down in one piece. Don't you think it's useful? I just had an idea. What do you think of this? Allow me to explain controlled explosion. Bomb blocks are hazards that turn blocks around them into cracked blocks. But dark blocks can never become cracked, so use this property to make paths. That's just inspired. What a great idea. Oh man, I wish I'd thought of that. Not bad. Wonder. Could it be that voice? It was my wife! You traitor! I'll kill you! That's what she said! I cheated on her, so she cursed me! Seriously? I didn't mean to. I mean, she asked me first. I can't believe this is happening to me! Anna, I climb and climb, but I keep seeing Anna's face, constantly hurting the one person that I love. Why am I alive? Why was I even born? Hey, are you alright? True freedom is the only chance I have left. True freedom is the only chance I have left. Here I am. You in there, buddy? We can talk once you sit down. Oh, man. This is the clock tower. The sixth floor. You're really good. You've been going at a pace of one floor per night so far. Come on, hurry up and ask your question. I want to get this over with tonight. This is the eighth question. If someone of the same sex as you hit on your significant other, what would you do? <laughs> so you choose that one. Hmm, I see. Do you remember what I told you before? That there is someone who put you here? Can't be. Whatever this place is, isn't it a dream? That's why even the smallest of fears and doubts become magnified here. <laughs> Remember that. of bomb blocks with different blast radii. How brightly they glow will help you figure out which is which. Not gonna die. Commencing area two. Are you ready?
Person to person, huh? In my case, it's my mother. She's coming after me to take me back, to lock me away. I managed to get away that day, but I've been running all this time since then, and now I, I don't want to return to that life. I need to keep techniques in my mind. I need to keep running. Hang in there, man. I, I don't want to return to that life. I need to keep techniques in my mind. I need to keep running. Hang in there, man. Uh, yeah. Things are getting tough around here. You can't always rise to every situation. But you can only fall to the level of your training. Like what? Try this one on for size. Allow me to explain bombs away. After activating a bomb block, quickly move it away from the area. If you push the bomb block off an edge before it explodes, the blocks around you will not be damaged. Did that seem useful to you? It should help. Have you seen this one? Allow me to explain Sproin. When you get on a spring block, you can jump upwards five blocks. You can move spring blocks, so use this knowledge to propel your skills to new heights. Nice! You're brilliant. All right, what's next? That sounds pretty useful. I expect nothing less of you. Anna, what is this dream anyway? They say it's about cheating, but I've never cheated. I see. So what's really going on? Have you cheated? Uh, yeah. There's a survey saying that 70% of men in relationships cheat. 
That makes me a minority. But just so you know, 40% of women cheat. It's the truth. Huh, really? A study claims that people attempt to create relationships resembling those of their pasts. Your childhood relationship with your parents, previous romantic relationships. That's what people are yearning for when they search for love. Okay, so what? Huh? Or, I'm sorry. Anyway, not cheating is the best course of action. It's a momentary thrill, but it costs so much more. You know what I mean? Anna, I've decided to let others help me. So I can reach true freedom. I'm going to climb. For Anna. Why do people fall in love? What? Some people say that you find that romantic spark when you encounter someone who compensates for your own flaws. By doing so, you can find an idealized version of a personality completely opposite to yours through a romantic relationship. In a nutshell, you're trying to get rid of the self you hate through romance. Hmm. That actually makes some sense. I do feel like I'm a better person when I'm with Anna. I'm not empty anymore. I'm not the me who can't do anything. So maybe that's why we fall in love. To accept who we are and live our lives. That makes romance seem awfully trivial. I'm going to climb. For Anna. All right! Hey, look! There's light shining through the windows. Wow. Can you see what it looks like outside? Wow. Anna. Uh. Man, I heard all over. Want some yummy juice? Hey, uh. Take one sheep and two blocks and crush him. Sheep juice. Use some wool as flavoring. Wool. <laughs> hey, I don't think he's up for talking. I don't want to be turned into juice. Fresh, pulpy juice from only the freshest sheep. Do I have to tell you? Sit down. Oh, man. Hmm. It seems you're getting used to the machine-based traps as well. Hey, what's up with those sheep that attacked me? Ah, yes. There are many sheep like that now. They've lost their sanity. If you lose your mind, all you have left to lose is your life. They don't exist in the real world anymore. You serious? This is the ninth question. Which is harder, lying or being lied to? <laughs> Which one? This one? one you chose. <laughs> I see. Oh, yes. You're in the middle of the clock tower stage. From the next section on, your trials will get longer and longer. But you're running out of time. Then hurry the hell up. I'll get out of here before the night is over. Very well. I'll take you to the next level.
It's a race against time. On this long staircase, use the items to your advantage and reach the door before you lose your footing. Just let me climb this tower like normal, damn it! Commencing Area 3. Are you ready? Right. I got it! Once again, you're quite tenacious. <sighs> I don't cheat. I don't go out and party. And the woman I love is... And I get these nightmares too? This sucks. Wait, there's more? I'm gonna throw my back out. I'm glad you made it up all right. It's like my hands are just moving on their own now. I don't know how I got so good at climbing this stuff. It's up above. I can feel it. Well, I can tell. I'm tired. I'm tired of this life of running. Hey, hey. Mother's hands. Oh, it's so cold. So cold. She never let me wear clothes. Instead of dragging myself through hell, maybe it's better just to die here. Uh, 
Oh, of course it is. What? Fuck, you don't know anything. I'm a bad man. I hurt women, my boss, everyone. I, I just... I just want a normal life. See? You want to live. I'll climb. I'll climb. Like there's no tomorrow. If we both survive, we'll meet again. Why is Mother coming back now? Hey, it's you again. Damn it. Why did he go away all of a sudden? Where did he go? Hey! Shut up! I can hear you! Sorry. Yeah, I understand. Been chased around by weird monsters every night. Well, go. There's another big one waiting to greet you tonight. <sighs> well, go. There's another. I should get going soon. Do you feel it? It will be coming soon. For me, it's myself. It's me in doll form, with holes for my eyes, ears, nose, mouth. And it doesn't even chase me. It's a version of me who doesn't do anything, who can't do anything. I would rather fall into oblivion than have to see that. Oh, come on. Anyway, let's try and come up with some techniques. Why don't we exchange some information? Sure. Here's something that I came up with. Allow me to explain Inazuma. When you're climbing a flat wall with three stones in a row, use the pulling out blocks and hanging techniques. If you repeat the same pattern, you can climb in a zigzag without collapsing the wall. Perhaps you already figured that one out, though. Well, hey, maybe this is related to your technique. This is a variation of Inazuma. You can climb flat walls with four stones in a row in the same way. The technique lies in moving the stone to the side of the wall you'd like to travel up, and creating a stepping stone. I see. You're quite something. Yes, what an elegant move. Are you going to devise some more techniques? Sorry guys, but I gotta go. <laughs> Wish you luck. Hello. This guy's come up with several techniques. It proves what kind of man he is. They're not new, but they're all logical and useful. That's the mind of a leader. I guess my business experience is paying off. It really does feel good to help out others. Hey, can you talk with us? You're the best climber out of anyone here. That's nice of you. So, I think the big one is coming up. Maybe I'm at the end of my rope. The big one? For me, it's my wife, Sophie. I as good as killed her anyway. She has every right to be angry with me. If she's the one who kills me, then I don't mind. Are you just giving up? Oh, right. I knew I recognized you. You're the one from the bar. I gotta pull myself together if I told you that much. All right. I'll go have a chat with Sophie. Sophie. Skills are remarkable. I don't care what little speech you have. Hurry up. This is the tenth question. If you begin to doubt your lover, would you reaffirm your trust in them or speak to them directly? <laughs> well, which one? That one, huh? Very well. I've noted it. Hurry up before I start getting nervous for no reason. <laughs> nervous, huh? I expect that you will be attacked by... something.
This is the final area for tonight. Observe the traps created by the enemy and stay calm. All right. Let's just climb this thing and get it over with. There is no way! I'm not your Child with Chainsaw has appeared. It's the killer. Do not die. Edge. Edge. Open this. Congratulations! 
The clock tower has chimed its final bell for you tonight. <laughs> here anyway I, I mean they the, the ants what, what are they doing here stupid ants they're after this what is it cake well who did you get this from I can't tell her that Catherine brought it oh I've got a, a real sweet tooth is all <laughs> uh, wait really so do I <laughs> So, uh, when did you get here? Oh, what, like you forgot? You said that you were feeling better, so I hurried right over. Huh? When did I tell you that? I guess my memory's a little fuzzy. Aww, you always say that. <laughs> Relax, you worry too much. Trust me, you are just fine, baby. <laughs> well, gee, thanks. <laughs> uh, oh yeah. <clears throat> I, uh, <laughs> don't have time today. Ah! No! What, what is it this time? It's, it's that horror movie I told you about. This is the last week they're gonna be showing it in theaters, <clears throat> remember? What, what movie? I don't know what I'm gonna do if I miss it. Yeah, okay, okay. Can we wait till tomorrow? I've kind of got some stuff to take care of today. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> All right! <laughs> This will be our first real date! It'll be so much fun, don't you think? <laughs> I am totally lost here. Ugh. Ugh. Yes! Ugh. <laughs> 